right, it's John from Foley Hardware and Home, and we're here this morning with John Stackpole from hey, Foley's John. Handyman. Right. Um, this is Fix It with Foley's, and we've got a quick fix uh, at the home. We get a lot of people come in, common problem, the screen door is opening too fast or too slow. We get calls from the handyman service, can you come fix my door? It's really a quick fix. You don't need um, handyman. We can come over and change these out for you. But, uh, John, show us what you would do to slow down or speed up the door. Uh, first of all, we have heavy weight, you know, so as long as you have the right uh, um, door closer, if you have a heavy glass door, a heavy weight, a light screen door, a regular duty and medium duty, and they come in different colors. But in terms of adjusting, it's still very important to adjust it to the right length. So you don't want to slam the kid's hands in the door. So what do sure. you got? So, um, you know, these these closers have really just one adjustment and it uh, on, on the front too, it actually has a, a speed adjustment uh, directions on making it faster or slow. Sometimes um, you might change out uh, from glass to screen. And if you have a gla glass in for the fall or the winter and then change out to uh, your screen, your storm door is gonna move much faster because there's a lot more air passing through the screening. So you might need to make an adjustment and just slow down your door a little bit. So it's something you have to do more than once. You just can't set it and forget it. Um, usually not. So okay. uh, basically all you have to do is Phillips screwdriver, very common, um, right inside the uh, piston. If you see, there's a there's a screw, and that's basically just an adjustment screw in the piston itself. Right on the end. Right on the end. And there's also, is there any indication of slow or fast on um, this? So there is on the label, okay. but the other thing is, is if you want it faster, you're going to give less pressure, and so you're going to so you're unscrewing it. unscrewing it. Okay. Maybe not all that way, but I just want to show that you know mm -hmm. it, it goes all the way out. And then, if in terms of a very light pressure, this this is easier to pull out. Exactly, that's what's going on there. Okay. So then, if you want you know more of a tightness, if you have the glass in and, and it's heavier um, yeah, to hold it back, exactly. You're going to tighten so it up. Usually what happens is you make an adjustment, you open the door like you're gonna go in the house or go back in the house and then go, go out and just feel or look to see how fast it's moving and make, make some adjustments yeah. uh, either faster or slower along the way. Sometimes you get it in one shot, sometimes you just need a couple of tweaks of the screwdriver. To, and you want it slow. heavy enough so that it actually latches shut because if it's too light, it won't close the latch. So there's a, there's a good balance and you just gotta do trial a and error. Absolutely. Um, just one thing to, to know with that, that comment is that if it doesn't um, get to the door or get to the jam fast enough, um, you, can, you can speed it up. But also sometimes it's just the pressure between the two doors. So if you've closed your front door and then your storm door goes, you know, all back like it would be closing. Um, it may not get there because there's too much pressure. So maybe just put your hand and finish it off, and that'll be that. You might need a little extra pull what? just to make sure it's locked so the wind doesn't catch it. Because that's the other thing that happens: the wind catches the door, rips it open. You got to replace everything. You got holes in your wood. But that's another story yep. for another time. Another story. John, you're busy. Start. You got to get back to work. I appreciate you coming in Thank this morning. John. And this is uh, Fix It with Foley's at Foley uh, Hardware and Home.